baby boy fights for his life after being shot in the head while sitting in a car. As Chicago police search for the shooter, community leaders offer a reward for information leading to an arrest. CBS 2's V. Wynn joins us live now from Comer Children's Hospital with the latest. V, good morning. Hey, V. Good morning, Aaron and Mike. Family is praying the one-year-old boy will make it through, but his grandfather told me off camera earlier this morning that things are not looking good for his grandson, Chase, who is now on life support. Now, detectives spent Thursday night looking for evidence and surveillance video in the Washington Heights neighborhood. The shooting happened around 5.30 p.m. at 99th and South Troop. Police say the one-year-old boy was sitting in the back seat of a parked car. He was in the car with four other people, two women and two children children ages five and four when police say a dark colored sedan pulled up. Someone got out and started shooting at them. The one year old was shot in the head. Police say a relative drove him to Little Company of Mary Hospital. He was then transferred to Comer Children's Hospital in critical condition. Loved ones have been here ever since. Now, Father Michael Flager, community community activist Andrew Holmes and Reverend Corey Brooks are now offering a $16,000 reward for anyone with information leading to an arrest. I did check in with police just moments ago and a spokesperson telling me that right now they are asking witnesses to please come forward to help them with this investigation. Reporting live from Comer Children's Hospital, V1 CBS 2 News. Aaron and Mike, back to you.